welcome to Anime and Watch Anime. This is the weekly segment <laughs> where we react, rate, and review any random anime for your viewing pleasure. I'm Zach. Joining me as always is my good buddy Travis. I'm Travis. And today, what are we watching? We're watching the arguably, arguably the worst anime ever made, according to some people, <laughs> uh, Redo of a Healer. Mom, it happened again. Damn it, bud. This is the fifth time this week. It's okay, Harold. No. No, it's not Mary. I'm sick and tired of this boy jizzing all over himself in the sheets. He has to borrow my sheets. Now I have my own son's jizz on my sheets. Ew. That's still gross, though. Kissing a person's eye. So what, what, what can I do? You'll get superpowers the next day. <laughs> Give me pink eye. Well, he just looks happy to be there. I just pictured a nerd saying that. Man, that's about level Chevy magic. I kind of like the anime interdimensional doctor who does. Aid. Yes, I did. I wish you had said specialist. Aids. <laughs> no, aids. Oh, he's looking at a past life. Not a future one, okay. Oh, that guy's a little stubby. So when he heals people, he also gets their, like, memories and pain. That sucks. Mm, yes! Pepto-Bismol! Mm. I thought this, uh, thought this anime would be a bit more crazy by now, but it's actually, like, uh, it's taking its time. I can't do that, Todd! No! Yes, I can't! It's in my rules! My healing can do anything I want it to do! This is why we don't let you play, okay? These imagination games, you just take it too far. There needs to be limitations! I gotta admit, I'm getting kinda tired of the cliche villain suddenly being happy that they lost. It's like, if you wanted that so bad, you could've just stayed still and let me kill you. じゃあ。やり直してまた出会った。今度はお前の全てを俺が奪ってやる。やめろ。どうだって、ベイベーが。やり直した世界でお前が俺をどう呼ぶか楽しみにしておくよ。ヒール。ヒール。ヒール。
だいぶ知識も得られたし夜の方も楽しませてもらった Wow, he's getting some every night そして Well, he, he, I think he said I think I caught it He said that like doing it with people It levels them up, but it also levels him up. So they're doing it to level up. Yes. Okay. Hi, yes. Grand Theft Auto, you wish to sue? Oh, hi, yes. God of War? Ah, yes. You wish to sue. He's <laughs> like, it's ridiculous. This guy is like, ridiculous. Down on me, just look at his sheets! <laughs> That's it, huh? Disappointing, right? A little bit. I mean, I guess I should be relieved. It's not like I want to see the disturbing stuff I've heard of. But at the same time, if, I, if I'm gonna watch it, then I'm expecting it. Alright. Well, that was the first episode of Redo of a Healer. Travis, what happened? Uh, our boy uh, gets the ability to look at his past life before he reversed the world and uh, realized that he was uh, abused, raped, drugged, um, manipulated to be this healer for this uh, very just cruel kingdom and their, their heroes. And then, uh, you know, he uses that information to uh, his advantage to uh, replay the... Uh, Basically, replay the events, but, um, changing the outcome. Does it work for you? Yeah, I like it. I like the idea of someone, someone, like, they're granted, like, I feel like the, this character is gonna go overboard. But, like, I like, I like, 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 Rising of the Shield here, I like stories like that. I like where a character is thrown down to the you know, to the very bottom, and then they have to, like, you know, that revenge. Again, I think Rising of the Shield Hero does it, like, like the best. That's how I feel when I see this. It's like, I feel like Naofumi basically getting his due justice within Rising of the Shield Hero, and I feel like that's the same thing here. And I like that. Hmm. Uh, I guess it works for me, too. Let I've heard it's a crazy show, but if I were to pretend like I've really never heard of this show, I feel like this is just another, like, oh, this is one of those animes that will probably be just okay. It has an okay premise. This guy wants revenge because he was, like you said, abused. Uh, and he was able to reverse time, and now he got his memory back. So now it's go time. Um, and if the show does it right, I think what it could do is it can make it so you do root for the character at first because you've seen all the terrible things he goes through but then over time you like him so much that you kind of don't want to see him like turn into the very monsters he hated from his first life so if they do that that would be really good but I don't know yet I've only seen the first episode who's your favorite character I'm gonna go with um that sword princess chick uh, that he healed. He, she was like one of the few people that was kind in his past life. And uh, I don't want to necessarily choose the main character because, like, I, I don't know. I did, I, you know, there's something, something icky. <laughs> when he makes that face, there, there's something icky about it, and I'm just like. I'm I'm not not for that, but like I like I like that character. I feel like if, if if the main character says she's kind and she's like, you know, the golden sunflower and uh and you know, she's the sunflower in like a field of weeds. Yeah. Uh, then I will agree with you because at first I was having trouble picking a favorite character because the main character whenever he makes that face gives me bad vibes. Again, it's that icky. You're just like ew. It's just like, dude, like, I'm sorry what happened to you, but I, I don't like that face you're making. All right, on a scale of one to five bed sheets. Bed sheets. The kids are mine, because I don't they're covered in his chairs. <laughs> How would you rate this? Oh, my God. Um, uh, the animation does look pretty good. The story is very, like, first episode. 
so I'm just gonna give it a three. Right down in the middle, three. I think like, you know, there is some good stuff I like, and there is some things I don't like, but overall it's just a very average first episode. A lot of people were like, it's just, it's just bad. It's just the worst anime in the world. Like, God, it just, I watched it and it burned my eyes. I went to church three days in a row because this, this anime <laughs> f***ed me up. And I did not see that. This was the most average thing ever. Uh, I, oh gosh, I'm gonna agree with you again, Travis. It's a three. Uh, it's fine. I assume the wild stuff happens after the first episode, and when people talk about this, they're not really counting the first episode. Or they just forget that the first episode's really tame. Yeah. In comparison to the rest of the series. Like porn. I assume. <laughs> right. Like, you watched the whole feature film porno, but you only watched, like, the first ten minutes. You'd be like, I don't get what the big deal is. Yeah, no one watches the first And then the guy minutes. drops his drawers and you're like, so that's the big deal. A <laughs> hundred views, and we will put the second episode on the Wheel of Senpai. And speaking of the Wheel of Senpai, it is time, once again, for the Wheel of Senpai. <laughs> You can I got eat this. it. I got this. Woo! One of these days, one of us is going to the hospital. We're gonna have to explain that we're spinning a wheel. Shangri-La. -La. All right. So next time we are watching Shangri-La. I think it actually is like Shangri-La Frontier. I think that's what what it, what the full name is. Probably. But that's for next time. In the meantime, I'm Zach, signing off, as always, with my good buddy Travis. And we will see you guys next time. Thank you for watching. If you're not subscribed, be sure to do so by clicking here. If you are subscribed, we thank you for keeping the anime dream alive. Be sure to check out our other content here and here. For even more content, be sure to check out the rest of our channel, and be sure to follow us on Twitter by clicking the link in the description below. I'm Felicia, and I'll see you next time.